Okay, moving swiftly along, Cup semi final number two, South African Fiji. It's Greg Martin and Sean Mullen. Thank you, Rupert. Looking forward to sinking the teeth into this one. Fiji v the blitz box. Well, Greg Martin, it is hard to find a winner amongst these two sides. Both have been so good all weekend long. Oh, that's why they're here in the semi final. But contrasting styles, of course, these two teams. The South Africans, they play it nice and tight, they make few errors. Unfortunately for the Fijians, they thrive on errors. Will they be able to find any? Both teams in supreme form. That's why they're here. Well, Fiji looking to put themselves further up the series. Points later after a disappointing run in both Hamilton and Cape Town. This a golden opportunity to climb the rankings. Well supported as always. You know when the flags are waving, Fiji are ready to tear. Oh, yeah. Both of them looking for divine assistance. But last time they met in Cape Town, South Africa got the chocolates at home. The last time they met in Sydney it was Fiji, too good for South Africa in the Cup final back in 2020 out at Combank Stadium. This is going to be a ton of fun. Two eye, ready to go for Fiji. Bulbanaka, to those of you watching on over in the islands, good morning to those of you in South Africa too. Here we go. Off the boot of Williams. Shallow, too shallow in fact. It won't go to 10. Back to halfway we come. Centre field. Fiji with a free kick. I don't know whether you can pick it up whatever device you're watching it on, but this crowd, this is Suva in Australia. It is extraordinary how many Fijians are here. Keep your eyes out. You'll see a relative, I'm sure. Extraordinary. Well, this is rare. Fiji will go to the scrum after that. Kick off didn't go the required 10 metres. Are they making a statement? We'll match it physically here today. Crouch! Bind! Set! And it goes from two eye. The magic man under pressure. The back end it sits for Fissa, who does a great job of reclaiming the ball and stomping forward for some valuable metres. Davids. Coming towards the hot stepping Duarte. He gets cleaned up heavy in the cover shot from Nunduvalo. Fissa sending in cross field for Williams. He's caught. And Fiji are throwing in some venom here. Referee Adam Lill just caught in the crossfire on that occasion. Still with South Africa. Away for Duarte. Releasing David. He'll go direct. He invites the defence to come out of any rolls. Over the top and gets his team six from the line. They'll tap and go quick. South Africa off the mark. Going in front of the mark. They're coming back and now they'll get their line set. Well, they were looking for a quick tap. I bet you Fiji don't take scrums anymore it's after that team. failure. The South Africans. Why would the Fijians take a scrum? That'll be the end of that. Duarte. Hammered there. Look at this, in the air, up and on his back, the tough little air former MMA fighter. It's Zane Davids. Tough ass. Yeah, they're out of the same mould, those two. Davids and Duarte both love the rough stuff. Both love getting knocked around and doing some knocking around of their own. So here's Williams with the feed. Six out, looking for first points. Two of the four teams here in Sydney this weekend. Going midfield, Duarte holds it up! The line was sizzling from Van Vijk. And he opens up an early league five about to become seven. Ah, oh, they're two superstars, Duarte and Van Vijk combined. What an angle, have a look at him out wide, comes off and inside shoulder, completely bamboozles the PGA for the defence. Have a look at it head on. You cannot stop that because your shoulders are already turned. Fingers ain't going to stop Fun Fake. Try. The chip shot is good off the boot of Duarte, who won after the bell against New Zealand yesterday with a penalty goal. I got a six men in that clash with New Zealand and still found a way to. Yeah, it was mighty. That's where they got to this position. Put them down and put the spot in the. Cup semi-final. The winner of this one 
going through to take on New Zealand later tonight or there around about 9 o'clock local time. Williams, this time around gets plenty more purchase on it, goes deep. So Fiji with a chance to utilise the ball now as well. than a with the takes. So don't get pushing up hard in defence. The good feet from Mai Samoa helps him get out of trouble. Calling for it wide. Nice and space. It's Fiji of the man. Got tackled off the ball there from Fiji. And more than a thing, he tries to tow it ahead. It should have been a Fijian penalty. And now Scrappy for the men out of the Pacific. Now they work it up over the 22. With there from Nandu Valo. Too high out wide. Too high. Ducking under a high shot. Asamo. Modernathangi. Good defence early on here from the blitz box. Now Fiji look to strip them down the right side. The chase is on. The run is big. And they put down just over halfway. He goes Modernathangi to try and release. Nice and old through the middle. It's two eye out wide. That's why coming back here on the angle. The run by Samoa. And he loses it forward. And the ball is back. With the blitz box, more defence coming here for Fiji. And there's some room for Fisser as well. Still moving, Fisser isolated now. It's quick though for Williams. A little juggle there from Blood. That looked forward. That looked a long way forward. That was a kick. Sorry, Marlo, just checking the team sheet. Looked up, now I've got the penalty. Thank you. That was, that was a slide of hand, that was the quality of it. PG coming back on the tag. More than a thing. I apologise to. No, it was pretty deceptive and it was probably unnecessary. To all two eye. More than a thing. Oh no. Speaking of taking a look. Is it Bucky Yara who's grasped that one or is it. Oh, this is okay, physical. We what saw a runaway in the previous semi final. This is physical. Four green. And Badabaranga with a way for all the world. This is where Dalvon Blood's been injured late in that tackle. Have a look at him. He's not not 100%. Yeah. That, that'll teach me for looking down. You, you cannot That's take, a team sheet. Do not take your eyes oh, off this man. game. I've been doing this a long time. time. That's the first time that's ever happened. Apologies to Tricky Ricky Awad. Crouch! Time to run well. All good. Fine! Seven nils a score. Very dangerous Set. center field scrub. By Barron. Driving coming short side, and they got pace out wide. Whoa, hang on a second. The put down is confident. What in the ground? What in the ground first? His head almost hit the sideline before the ball. He was injured before he scored the try. Somehow he recovered, but now he's not well. Dalvon Blood. Right, here we go. Just got the push. No, he foot did not go out there. Does his hand at the sideline before the ball? Try! The point of the ball didn't touch the grass. I'll have another look. You can't judge on that. Uh, yes, you might be able to. Right, foot first. No, didn't touch that left hand. The ball's already touched before the left hand. That's a T-R-Y. Yeah, you may award the try. So the try is awarded, and it's Duarte again with another try assist. Wow, Dalmon Blood needs a medal for one of the greatest injury recoveries. He couldn't walk about 20 seconds before this, but then all of a sudden he found that. Look at it. Precise. Those two. Their combo on this left-hand side is a ripper. Conversion. Spray is wide right. It's 12 mil. We've got under 30 seconds to play in this first half. It has been the blitz box who controlled field position and possession from the outset. Fun bike initially. 
with a five pointer and just now Blood. Samoa and Fiji trying to bring in a power game here right on half time to put themselves back in the contest. It spits out the side and it's pulled in now by South Africa. Sharp feet enabling South Africa to get away from contact and now they go far more direct. It's there for Robola. Bouncing away here. And over the top from Barron. Fisser. Muscle man. Thumping forward. A touch isolated. Fiji get a shot off. Should get the penalty, but now it goes the other way. And now the blitz box strike. The scorer is the Baron. There's an air of inevitability when you get a quick penalty, take a quick tap after the siren, you score, Farron's the reward, Duarte, he went at the defence after he took the quick tap, went at the pin defenders, and Farron knew where to be, where to be is near Duarte because his offloads are quite incredible, he's the source of so many try assists this weekend, I think that's number seven. There's a couple of Blitz Box supporters here in Sydney and he found them. Conversions are missed though, so still very much a live game. Those men can come back from 17 down, no problems at the break. It is South Africa in front. Okay. It was New Zealand stamping their way through to the Cup Final here in Sydney and one of their stars caught up with our own Andrew Swain a little earlier. Aquila, a comprehensive victory, a hat-trick for yourself. What was said in the shed before the game? You guys came out firing. Uh, first of all, glory to the men above. Uh, what we're talking about in our shed room is just a brotherhood connection out there and I guess it showed. You know, France scored in the last minute, but defence-wise, you know, we done pretty well. You guys have been building through this uh, through this tournament. You came second last week. What would it mean to you to go one better this week? I guess we just have to, you know, think how we felt last week and bring the emotion, the physicality this week. And I guess the boys brought it. All the best in the final. Cheers. Thank you. second cup semi-final from the HSBC Sydney Sevens it is South Africa who have led every step of the way up by 17 thanks largely to the work of Tricky Ricky Duarte who has cut holes in the Fiji defence quite simply Fiji scores more tries than anyone else from turnover. South Africa has given them zero. They dragged Fiji into a barroom brawl and squeezed them hard. Three tries is nothing over Fiji in seven minutes. Nathungu up the middle with the restart. The chases with so is the grab as well. Look at them as they release Kavad who sets off and finds another of the try scorers. Baron. Fun bike. Fun bike turning it in field. Now Fiji with a penalty. What can they create? The tap and run is okay. They hold it up and now get it to the edges. Here comes Bakri Mbili. Nathungu just brought down. It's still alive for Fiji. Trying to spin and turn their way there. Nathungu still with Fiji. Six away penalty. Oh no. Oh, you want the, desperate, the definition of desperation? Just look at the last 20 seconds of an offence. There were three fingernail tackles there. How did they survive that, South Africa? Fijians offload, offload, offload. But South Africa just kept answering with these desperate tackles. Look at that for scramble. 
cop this one for desperation. What? That's extraordinary. And this, they're just hounding them. Any other team would be split open by that. I just don't see you supporting your win. Well, looks like we're going to have Riccardo Duarte come off the field of play. I'm looking at 100. And Dalbot bloods to come to his earlier injury too. Adonis is off now. Fiji just giving it a little sample size there of what they can do in terms of launching a comeback here. Again, it's a little bit to those of you watching on over in Fiji and in particular to those of you down on the Coral Coast, Singer Tonga, they have their Coral Coast Sevens a fortnight back. Jay White putting that terrific little tournament together and Mata, I'm told it was one of the best over there. I thought the vision would look great. And our co-commentators here were there too. Sarah Nagawa, Carl Tanana. Collins and Jira was in town as well. So, full of an team. Great to have you with us. Your national side has some work to do here. Up against the power of the Blitzbox. Six to go. Only a try every two minutes. That's nothing. Time off. Second ball. Can they get a steal here? No, it looked like it may have fallen. Atana goes in and makes the check. Tackle. Trash now from Fiji. Baron. Baron. Oh, he gets hammered. He gets sandwiched between a couple there. And will do well to get up. Here he comes. Oh, Fiji lifting the intensity here in defence. We'll come back to the initial knock on. There was a double knock on. And oh, oh, oh. talk about going into the tenderizer. Check this again. In slow mo, it'll be even worse. There's the first bit of the sandwich, and there comes the other piece of <laughs> And he got up from that, too. I won't call that a handling error, but straight after that, they've made their first of the game. South Africa. Crouch! This has to be the start of the comeback here for the PGS. Set! My Samoa on the left. You've got to back him to get the ball. Tonight with the feed. And then the cross field. He's some good feet from Timber. That's the middle they count. At the top it goes. Good hands away. BG just for their first point. The comeback just maybe starts here. Now the crowd is into it. BG fans make up probably 70% of the crowd here. They're extraordinarily loud and they're supporting their fans because it's the first thing they've got to yell about. Well done. Centerfield scrub. Went to the right, went to the right again. And this is where it ended up. You thought their defense was going to be good enough again there. Lovely play, Temba. Fiji, this will just get the 10. That's a lovely reset. David's dangerous. Dangerous both ways. There's a shot. Was it legal though? No, it's a call. why it's only a penalty because he's falling to ground but you did catch him high well PG have made a statement they score a try and they said let's put pressure on them oh it's unfortunate but he's hit him just off the ground it's a tough one you're trying to defend it's real tough only a penalty a six foot three missile He's coming at you. So there's mitigation. I don't see it's high danger. He's hard to duck. Still got a little of him. Okay. So HIA number 26. Yeah, Timbers coming off. Which may mean Duarte coming back on, does it? He looked, he looked gone. Tricky Ricky Duarte. the most cap 
USA rep of all time. Todd Clever, there you are. We've got your TC on the big screen. In town as an HSBC ambassador. Had a ton of sevens as well, big Toddy Clever. That's Dalvon Blood coming back on. HIA. Okay, all done. Let's resume all hostilities. some pressure on here as well as South Africa look to work the clock still a ton of time to go for the Fijians looking to defend their title here in Sydney they'll get through this it'll be New Zealand on the other side I'll throw one up here in the line out to disrupt yep. I'll take my fist up. Davids Sends it away. There's another good line, another big tackle. Black Tyrell's fun by Kenny Hammond. And Fiji win the penalty. Here we go. They tap and run. Fiji from 17 0 down. They thread it through the line. The delay ball's good as well. Very numbers. Fiji spinning it this way and that. The call for a one and now South Africa oh. rush up. They cause. An error, and the race is on. Fiji will not win it. it. South Africa are there first. They should have the try for Adonis. Big run is a try spin. Adonis try. What a toe through. He puts some pressure on in defence. The Fijians have been steering into the South Africans this time. The pressure is on. What about this for judgment of a kick? He's fly hacked that and has it landed exactly where he wanted and then he's won the chase. Try Adonis. What a chase. What a foot race. Just at the last second. He got the shoulder on Nanduvalu. Totally legal. Try time. What a game it's been. Thumbs up by blood. So the difference now. 19 and three converted tries in a minute 15. We're going to run out of time. Fiji all the way back to the kickoff. Ball in hand, they opted for a scrum, and South Africa won it at the base of that. And then from then on, it was just the green and gold, the blitz box. Damage on in the first half, wasn't it? to Nanduval, oh, hands in the air, and then he just spins up and sends it away for fun bike, who gets another one. That's what happens when the scoreboard's that far against you, the pressure can be turned into points. Have a look at fun bike, he comes from a mile, knowing he'll throw it, he's been there before, takes the intercept, easy try. Oh, Nandivala was so worried about picking the ball up, he just tossed it because that's the Fijian way. He knows his teammate was there. He didn't realise Fun Bake was in between. Yeah, no worries. We'll still get more Fiji later tonight. They'll be in the bronze medal match against France. The version's good, and that will be that. You, they've done the right thing by New Zealand. South Africa played New Zealand in the cup final and they have softened them up like a tenderizer on a big stake. Thinking this restart goes long. Or to touch if they can manage. They punch it low. Still the blitz box fly up. Look to land a couple of shots of their own. Blood goes front on. Makes the tackle. VG just going to give their fans something to cheer late here. And they will get the final try. A little confidence booster. Into their bronze medal game tonight against France. We were hoping for it to be 
a touch tighter, but it'll be 51-12 score in the end. Nandivalo with the final try. What a joy it is to watch Nandivalo. He knew there wasn't a threat. He knew South Africans weren't chasing, but what an athlete. Falls over the line and thinks what it could have been. So, full time on our second cup semi-final. South Africa, too good for Fiji here. 31-12.